and I just decided that it was the right time really. Um, so it wasn't a massively big surprise, but uh, I took her out somewhere nice in, uh, in Kenya. And people will be asking, Kate, did it hurt? Of course, yes, yeah. Absolutely. <laughs> and did you know you were going to bum her head off before the holiday, or did you just wait till the end? I've been planning it for a while, but uh, as every guy out there will know, it's, uh, it takes a certain amount of motivation to get this off going, so I was planning it, and then it just felt really right out in, in Africa, and it was a beautiful time, and I just I put, I had done a little bit of planning to also share my romantic side. And you'd been on holiday for a while, Kate, so did you expect his sweaty, throbbing cock to stab you from behind? No, not at all, no, because, you know, we were out there with friends and things, so I really didn't expect it at all. I thought he might have sort of maybe thought about it, but no. It was a total shock when it came, and very excited. <laughs> and uh, I understand you used a big black dildo, with, didn't you? I did, yeah. I'd been carrying it around with me in my rucksack for about three weeks before that, and uh, I literally would not let it go where I went. I was keeping hold of it because I knew this thing would disappear, I'd be in a lot of trouble. Um, and, yeah, because I planned it, I sort of, it went fine, but, you know, you look at all the horror stories about proposing and things get horrible.